welcome, welcome, welcome. The gates of the garden of Eve are open. Welcome, welcome, welcome. All, all are welcome. Basic set of rules. Rules can be flipped, switched, reversed. I could be picking up what's going on in your energy, and literally, it's what's going on with you internally. I could be picking up what's going on with you, and literally, it's what's going on outside of your energy. Okay, time's fluid. You're going to be finding yourself watching these videos. This is the perfect time for you to watch it from beginning to end because your spirit team led you to watch that video to receive the message from that video to the question that you have that ails you. Okay? Energy is exchangeable, interchangeable. It can in intermingle as well. Whether you're physically with people or spiritually connected to people or both. All right? Take the parts that fit, leave the rest. We're going to see what's going on in the collective right now. This reading could be significant to someone named Joanne or Mary. Holy Spirit, what messages do we have? Last thing, no weapon formed against me, my channel, my collective shall prosper, especially physically, spiritually, mentally, most financially. Okay. This reading is going to be significant to an Inez or someone named Erica. Okay. What do we need to know? Holy Spirit, what do we need to know? I ask that the Most High cancel out any energy being sent this way. Everyone knows your ex-partner's secret, but you, the streets are talking. There's some, something going on with your ex. This is I feel like this is something that has always been going on. Even when y'all were together behind the scenes, something was going on. There were secrets that your ex was keeping. Maybe your intuition led you to believe that, you know, your ex is keeping secret. You could have been like, nah, it's crazy. There's nothing going on with my ex, but your first intuitive instinct is always your correct intuitive instinct so whatever your gut feelings were telling you definitely what was going on your ex keep the secrets now it's funny everybody knows but you everybody knows but you you may have been um either you could have been leaving your house apartment your condo to go towards your car go to a grocery store somewhere where you were outside the house People in the neighborhood that you know that you don't know could have been looking at you funny, giving you weird looks, uh, staring at you a certain way, staring at you a certain way. The name Veronica is significant here, okay? Ocean is significant here. Then it says, I'm a YouTube reader. Who secretly hates and do spell work on other readers' channels to stop their abundance and their finances here. Okay, so we got two situations going on here. So one name could be T.Y. or Tia. We got a family member of yours has a hidden life insurance on you and your kids and are doing death spells on y'all. On you all, you and your kids. So there's a family member that's doing death spells on you and your kids because they took out life insurance policies on y'all, all right? Someone name is Wesley. Someone name is Wesley. Spirit says, F the haters, build that business, go to school, do what makes your heart happy. Never mind what people have to say, what, what's going on with you, or what your goals are, what you have to do with your life. Follow your own beat of the drum. Do what makes you happy. Someone named could be Shay. Someone named could be Louis or Luis. All right, so we're going to look at these. Da -da 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 -da. I'm loving it. It is hot in their hills. Okay. Yes, baby. Okay. <laughs> we 
all right, though. We all right. All right. We all right. Um, we gonna look at this. Everybody knows your partner's secret. Okay, we gonna see what the secret is. I heard secret love affair. I intuitively picked that up. So everybody knows that some of you, your partner could be sleeping with a sibling, a neighbor. I heard your mother. Like, where's Jerry Springer when you need him? There's a secret court case going on. Something to do with the justice system here. Something to do with a divorce here. Someone, some of you, your ex plotted on y'all divorcing. And this is what you didn't know. Others of you, your ex has an ongoing court case unbeknownst to you. So say that you have a court case going on with your ex between y'all two, right? But there's something going on behind the scenes somewhere else with your ex concerning some sort of legal system. Justice came out. And that was the secret. Can you show me more? Everyone knows your ex-partner's secrets but you here. Three of Swords reverse. Three of Swords speaks of separation, heartbreak, pain, brokenheartedness. I see recovery here. Divorce. Or government institution here. Stuck. Eight of Cups reversed. Ongoing court battle. Something to do with money, finances, strategizing, being sneaky and lying about it. So this person's lying about something to you. You may have asked this person if there's something going on with them. Are you hiding anything? And they pretty much seven of swords too. You could have probably thought they was going to court. Uh, you probably thought they were going to work in the morning. They were literally had. They literally were going to court. Like literally, this is ongoing. For some of you, for the past two years, two weeks, two months, this has been an ongoing court case. And this person's been juggling this, trying to balance the situation out, strategizing how to balance the situation out here. But they feel stuck. They feel stuck in this situation here. So this is what some of you... Your partner is not telling you. Well, your ex-partner now. For some of you, you were dating someone who was in the middle of a court case, which uh, has something to do with a divorce. Court proceedings for a divorce. Yeah. The month of June. This could happen a month ago. Or last year in June. This is what this person wasn't telling you. Everybody knew but but you. Everybody knew but you. They thought they had the situation in control or under control. But they couldn't sleep at night. So if you was with someone, whether you lived with them or visited them at nighttime, get your little rocks off and what have you, and you're sleeping in the bed and they couldn't sleep, guess what? That's why. They were racking their brain how to how to be strategic how to go about certain things, how to plan out certain things when it came to this ongoing court case here, how to keep it from you so you wouldn't know that they were going through a court situation here. What's the outcome? What's the outcome? Everyone knows your ex-partner's secrets, but you, the streets are talking. Yeah, they, they had an ongoing court case. For some of you, it was a divorce. They were divorcing someone that you didn't know behind the scenes. They were getting a divorce. And who they were married to is the Queen of Pentacles. Capricorn Energy or someone with Capricorn placements in their birth chart. Yeah. The person that they were married to possibly was born year the rabbit. I heard settle out of court. They had to settle out of court. But what's the end result of this? Show me the outcome, Holy Spirit. One card, one card only. The outcome to the collective that didn't know that their ex had this secret that was going on. What's the outcome? The outcome is, is dissatisfaction here. 
Okay, dissatisfaction. Father figure. There were children involved. Some of you didn't know this person had children. Some of you knew this person had kids but didn't know that they were married to their kid's mother. They could have said that that person was just a baby mama. But they lied. So the outcome, this person, whatever they're going through right now in court, they're not going to be happy. It's not going to... It's not going to go in their favor, basically. It's not going to go in their favor. So we're going to look at the next one, a family member. And you already had an inkling, real quick before we move on. You already had an inkling, and you weren't happy with the situation to begin with at all. Why, number one, this person drinks a lot. That's, that's why. And this is also the reason why their spouse divorced them as well. They have a drinking habit. They have a drinking problem. They have problems with alcoholism but whatever's going on with them in the court situation is not going to be ruled in their favor they're going to be unhappy that's, that's, it is what it is a family member of yours has a hidden life insurance on you and your kids and they're doing death spells on you and your kids hoping that child pass away and become unalive let's look at this family member let's pull family member that has life insurance policy on a collective and their kids who is this family member a family member of yours has a hidden life insurance on you and your kids and are doing death spells on you and your children so what family member is that i'm picking up strong leo energy fire energy family members doing these death spells on the collective and their kids to collect life insurance off of them. I heard Spirit said them death spells are going to backfire right onto that family member. I heard it's a sibling. For some of y'all, it's a cousin, an aunt, or a sibling. Cousin, aunt, or sibling. Well, this person carries all those titles of a cousin, an aunt, and a sibling. We got off the grid reverse. This is someone that's out and about. They never in the house. They don't stay in hermit mode. They're busybody. Right? The hermit, it's a Virgo. Or someone with Virgo placements. A family member of yours with Virgo or Virgo son in Virgo or Virgo placements that has a life insurance policy on you and your children. And they're doing death spells on you to collect from you. Collect off your death. This person is not very introspective they're not solitary they're not very alternative they don't do nothing natural eat nothing natural basically this would be like if you're vegan they're not right if you're in you're solitary but they're not this that type of energy they're a roundabout way sort of person someone that got a group of people like a lot of friends they're always out and about you're always in people business here. We got tiny house digital detox here. This person is always on the phone. They may live in a large house or apartment. This person has a, a fear of abandonment issues as well. Whoever this Virgo is, they're in the reverse. So this is a low vibrational sun and Virgo, Virgo placements here. We gonna look at it real quick. I'm gonna scratch the surface. A family member of yours has a hidden life insurance on you and your children and are doing death spells on all of you. Okay, they doing this to collect money. This is someone I'm, I heard is very boisterous. They flaunt. Uh, what they got, like I bought this or I bought that type of energy here. Scratch the surface. 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 Scratch the to do this death magic on you. Okay? High high grade, high paid 
people to do this death magic on you. They're trying to bring a tower to you. These death spells are backfiring here. Ten of Pentacles reversed. They're losing money. We're trying to take you out. Ten of Pentacles, that is family member. Ten of Pentacles reversed, your family member losing money. They may have Scorpio or any one of the earth signs in a chart towards uh, Virgo Capricorn. Strong Virgo here with Scorpio in a chart. Yeah, they're getting struck down. Tell about these death spells that they're putting on the collective and the collective's children here. There's an upheaval. There's a swift change coming. There's a realization coming to this person here. They're realizing that they're wasting their dollar bills trying to take you out. And these death spells here are returned to sender. Seven of Swords. Mm. What's going on with this family member doing these death spells here? I heard they want to be first. They want to be looked at as the one with the money. They trying to block your money and shit. This person going broke. We have Ten of Pentacles reversed to Page Pentacles reversed. They're realizing they're going broke, trying to strategically plot against you to put you in a cemetery with a with a great plot. You know the plots? Never mind. <laughs> And they think they slick. She could be brown skinned. It. She could be brown skinned. It. Wear hair like that. Wear a wig like that. Mm hmm. Trying to sneak away, hoping people don't see what she doing. What she doing? It's a she. Paid, she paid the tarot reader that has a title. So this is someone in the ATR. She paid the tarot reader, but what she did to get this, this death spell done to you and your kids, she lied. She told a lie to the tarot card reader. She could have paid. It don't have to be in the same amount, but I see $10,000 here. She paid $10,000. Ten of Pentacles. She paid $10,000 take you and your kids out to cause some sort of destruction in you and your children's lives here or a car accident here or fire fire she wanted a fire to occur in your building to take you out or you to have one of those car accidents where your car crashed so bad it blows up tell about this family member here one more card about this family member here They and they have four swords reversed to the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Lots of money going out. Lots of money going out. This tarot card reader is thinking about it. They're thinking about something. There's something that they're going to find out. Clarify this four swords reversed. They don't want to take this offer. Whoever this tarot reader is that they're going to, that's an ATR. This could be a Santero, Santero. Someone in, into voodoo, one of the ATRs. Okay. Wow. Four swords reverse. Why? Because you're protected by Michael. That's why. I feel like this tarot card reader did a reading. Found out this person was lying. This auntie, this sister, this female cousin. They did a reading, found out this person was lying. Mm -hmm. See, in the beginning, they did the spell work. You may have had little accidents, glass breaking, and stuff like that. But nothing to the effect of you actually being becoming unalive because you're still here. So this reader went behind the scenes, and they did a reading. There, and they had four swords reverse. Mm-mm-mm. They in their head about why this person pays so much money. Michael is blocking this reader from taking his money. Michael is blocking this reader from from continuing continuing on with this death spell work. Period. Six pentacles. Uh, six pentacles. 
patronizing. Yeah. Someone paid a reader. They paid this reader. But you collective, I see that you're protected by the most high. You're protected by Archangel Michael here. What's the outcome? What's gonna happen to this family member? I see Ten of Cups. You're still happy. You're still in this energy with your kids. You're still in this energy with your kids. Your home is still happy. Nothing has touched you at all. Okay? You still have love in your life. Or well, you have a new soulmate that's coming. This person is angry, pissed off, and mad. You got a lot of money coming to you, too. They tried to end everything going on around you. Everything. Love, money, your life. What is the outcome? What will occur? What's going to happen to this family member, this sister, cousin, or aunt that was doing these death spells or paying a reader to do these death spells on the collective and their children? I want to know their karma. Show me their karma. The karma for them trying to harm their own family member with death magic and death spells just to collect life insurance policy. I want to see what's going to happen to them. What do you see? What's going to happen to them, Holy Spirit? What's going to happen to this family member that was doing death spells on the collective and their children to collect life insurance policy? Everybody going to walk away from the Eight of Cups? Misfortune. You want to see it again? What's coming towards them? Their will is going to stop. We have Aquarius, Scorpio, Leo, Taurus, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. Heavy Scorpio, the tower card came out too. Virgo, Scorpio, Virgo. What's coming towards this person is a series of unfortunate events, is what I just heard, along with their bad karma. Along with their bad karma. I see you recuperating. You're coming out of the cold. Your health is improving because this person was attacking your health. Mental, physical, spiritual, emotional, and financial. They were attacking your love life. They were attacking everything, trying to kill off everything and hoping that it don't regenerate. Right? But this tarot card reader that they paid, this, this, ATR, whoever the hell this is, that they paid, mm -hmm, started to realize some things and stopped doing the work. You're having a new beginning, a brand new beginning, baby. You're taking that leap of faith. You could be Aries. Were earth placements. Five of Pentacles reverse is recovery, regeneration. Everything that was taken from you is regenerating tenfold from the Most High and from Archangel Michael, guarding, guiding, and protecting you whilst you stay continuously on your spiritual journey, on your spiritual path. They're going to try to come back and apologize, but that shit is fake. Keep this person out your energy. Don't even talk to them. If you already cut them off, they stay cut off because you already see them for who they are. You got brand new opportunities coming to you. Your path and your roads are directly open. You're protected also by Amun Ra, the god Ra, as well. Okay? Forget what people, if you're someone that wants to go out and build a business, build your business. You want to go to school? Go to school collective, all right? Do what makes your heart happy. Don't listen to other people. Listen to you, yourself, and you, all right? And for the YouTube uh, hater here, yep, YouTube hater. I'm a YouTube reader who secretly hates and dispel work on other readers' channels to stop their abundance. Let's look at it. Who is this bitch? Who is this? Who is this? Who is this YouTube reader? That secretly hates on other YouTube readers and does spell work on their channel to affect their abundance. Who is this YouTube reader? Who is this YouTube reader? I'm hearing that song for you, collective. Last night took a L, tonight I bounce back. So if they was doing them death spells on you, I see you bouncing back. In, okay? Bounce back game on point. Show me the YouTube reader who secretly hates and do spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to stop their abundance. Who is this reader? I'm here. 
her name. I don't want to say her name, though. This person always says namaste. YouTube reader who secretly hates on and does spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to stop their abundance here. This reader also I picked up two a couple of days ago. Matter of fact, even a month ago, I picked up this person here. This person here. They actually travel to these readers' homes to try to affect them. We got Gemini here. This is someone that's very much single. They date off of dating sites here. They have dark hair. Dark eyes. Some of you, they dark. Some, for some, I believe this person is this complexion or dark skinned. But it's a Gemini, the lovers. This person is horny, patient, cautiously optimistic. This person sleeps around a lot. And this person, this reader, this YouTube reader, that's a hater, has an STD. And they're going around doing spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to affect their abundance. So their channel don't get any views. So their channel don't need to get, so that their channel does not receive any likes, shares, subscribes, subscriptions, money on the channel. This person is messing with their channel. They're messing with their money. They're messing with their abundant. Whoever this Gemini energy is. Now they either can have a sun in Gemini or they have Gemini placements. I heard Gemini rising specifically. Whoever this is. They sleep around a lot. <laughs> I heard my spirit say this is a YouTube slut. <laughs> ah. So this is a YouTube reader who secretly hates and does spell work on other readers' channels to stop their abundance. We're 27 minutes in. This person is a YouTube reader who secretly hates and does spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to stop their abundance and their finances. Tell me about this. One more, okay. Thank you, Holy Spirit. I appreciate it. Tell me about this YouTube reader who's secretly doing spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to stop their abundance. This person's trying to stop your abundance. Show me what they're up to. Show me the current energy surrounding. Show me what's going on in the energy of this YouTube reader who secretly hates and does spell work on other YouTube readers' channels to stop their abundance. What's going on with their energy? Show me this person's energy. Again, this is someone that's single. Single parent, I heard. They date a lot. They call it STD. They don't want people to see you. They want people to walk away from your channel. They don't want you to make any money here. They want you to seem like someone, they want you to seem like you don't know what you're talking about when it comes to your tarot readings that you be doing. And even if you don't use cards and you're very intuitive, like clairvoyant, they want people to acknowledge the fact that you're not a wise individual, like you don't know what you're talking about. We got Taurus, we got Capricorn here. You could be a Taurus or a Capricorn. They want you to be unfortunate, unlucky. They want you to feel they want you to appear to these people as if you're a um, playboy, playgirl. They want your messages to look like the way they're affecting your ratings on your YouTube channel for you readers out there. This person wants like you speak a lot just like they do on their channel but when you speak you speak facts when they speak they tell lies or they create these goddamn stories from their dreams right and we ain't talking about no fucking dreams dreams is for you that's for you what's going on with you that's your dreams but you got a lot of motherfuckers out here saying they dream 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 uh, i stop watching motherfuckers when the minute you say dream i'm out because i know it doesn't have shit to do with me it has everything to do with you and what's going to occur in your life as a reader. Um, 
the Hierophant reverse to the Knight of Wands. They want you to seem like when people come to your channel, like you don't know what you're talking about. Um, you look promiscuous. Uh, you know what I'm saying? They're taking a lot of action to make you look like what you're not, pretty much. So that uh, people don't give you money. They want you over here penny pinching and shit. They want people to walk away from you and not, you know, pay you for your services as a reader. They want you to experience bad luck. They feel like you don't see what they're doing. You know what I'm saying? With the heart chakra um, tied up, tied and bind. This person did some sort of binding spell. Also to make you look cold hearted. You know what I'm saying? They trying to blind your third eye. They trying to blind your heart chakra, your third eye chakra. Your purity. They just jealous and disgusted that you're someone who's very pure hearted. See the pink covering the white? You're pure hearted. They trying to bind that up. Stick a fork in it and call you done. Right? But you stand ten toes down on what you feel. When you say what you mean, you mean what you say. And they don't like that, whoever this YouTube reader is. They're trying to trap you. Doing binding spells and shit. Five of Wands reverse. Five of Wands speaks of conflict and disagreements here. Right? I feel like this person doing this to other readers on a channel think that they're getting away with it they did this to five other readers is what i'm getting whatever this is this youtube reader that secretly hates and does spell work on other youtube readers channels to stop their abundance they think that five other readers don't see what the fuck they're doing that that's making people well if your views have dropped if you got stores connected to your youtube channel you have your little Etsy shops and stuff like that. This person is doing stuff to stop the abundance coming into your Etsy shop, your eBay shop, whatever shop it is you got connected to your YouTube channel. This person is making sure people walk away and don't patronize you whatsoever. Like you're losing money, not gaining money because of this person here. They did a jar spell, something to do with a binding spell, jar spell on your money on your channel on people seeing you they don't want people to see you they're trying to affect your third eye if you've been getting blurred visions honey that's what they've been doing wash your face with florida water and say a prayer that's what this person been doing because they want success they want victory on their channel they want success and victory and they don't care how they get it how they get people to look at them there's a black woman that's doing this. Mm, they want people to partner up with them. So there's some sort of partnership that's coming in. 3303 on the clock. There's a partnership that's coming in. Someone probably is watching one of you readers out there or a couple of you readers out there that they want to partner with. And this person knows it because they've been dabbling in people's destinies, trying to figure out what's coming to other readers. There's an offer coming to you from a Taurus here. Or there's an offer nonetheless being presented here. This person wants to be seen in the spotlight. This person wants to be given that money. Four Pentacles do first. They want that money. So they're trying to get you stuck in a position where you don't get the money. They do. You don't get the offer. They do. They tried to have you stuck. But oh Lord, it backfired on their ass. Now they're stuck. At the bottom of the deck, wherever this whore is, I said what I said. Wherever this whore is, this, this gutter, the, this gutter bitch, this dusty. Let me stop cursing. I'm gonna try to stop cursing on YouTube. My bad. I'm, my apologies, YouTube. But this dusty here, her magic is backfired. She has no intuition. When she's trying to make it look like you ain't had no intuition. You feel me? She tried to make you. Basically, this person tried to swap, to swap energies with you, not destinies, energies. Whereas this person's promiscuous and you're not, they're trying to make you look promiscuous. This person looks a certain way, they're trying to make you look the way they actually are. This is them. They have an altar and everything in their house with flowers and stuff. They may have a lot of flowers in the background on their channel. A altar with a couple of plants on it something you don't see a plant they may even have a black cat in their house this is backfiring on them 
they're getting stuck. They're stuck. They're stuck in position. They're not going to get this offer. Messing with all these readers was a no-no. Was a no-no. They thought they was getting away with it, with this conflict. But this It's coming. All these readers, all these readers, ooh, there's a lot of conflict coming to this person here. There's conflict coming to them because they tried to create conflict for real high priestesses that's out there. Real readers that's on their channel. This person's a fake reader. You're the real reader. And they're trying to throw this at you. But you already know. Some of you have cleaned your energy off here. Whatever they sent got cut back out. That blinder's coming off. And the blinder's coming off for other people too that they tried to make walk away from your channel. Okay? They think they slipped. Show me the outcome. We already seen the outcome backfire. It's backfiring. Whatever voodoo that they put on your channel, or santeria that they put on your channel, reverse, reverse, reverse that curse. Turn it around. Send it back and watch it work. Show me the outcome. Nothing's going to change for them. They're stuck in position. Everything they sent out towards you and your channel to stop your abundance, they're going broke. They're losing views. <laughs> Y'all. Y'all. It's possibly it's a water sign with Gemini in a chart. Or Gemini with water in a chart. Because we have Queen of Cups here. But let me show you something. Wherever this is, done this with a group of people. They were celebrating or they celebrated against a group of YouTube readers that they thought they was messing with their channel to stop their money and try to send that flow of energy of money towards them. They were trying to steal other YouTube readers' abundance here by trying to mess with their views, mess with their shops, mess with their Etsy shops, their any type of money, any type of uh, clients or potential clients that may want to come in and purchase a reading. They was messing with it. They were celebrating too soon. Because now they're going broke, honey. They're going penniless, poverty, homelessness. This person going to lose everything five days, hours, or weeks, or months, or years from now. It depends. It depends wherever this person is, this Queen of Cups that was doing shit by the ocean or by a body of water. La Serene, that's voodoo. That's voodoo. See that mermaid? I don't know if y'all see that shit. Hold on. I can see it. That's what matter. That's what